What's, what is it a base four or three? What, what's, what? Yeah, well, we're going to be a multiple. multiple. We, multiple. We're going to be a multiple attack front. Uh, you're going to see a little 34, you're going to see a little 43 uh, and different things. Uh, I know, uh, you know, from, from looking at the other side, uh, they're going to do basically some of the same things. Uh, you know, I, I see Coach Blunt has moved over to the 34 uh, and different things. Uh, so uh, it's going to be a sighting game because we know they, they got uh, all 11 coming back. So uh, on defense, so I know they're going to be ready to rock and roll also defensively. Coach, if you had to look at it, what would be three keys to the victory this weekend? The biggest three keys I always look at, number one is discipline. You know, if we're, if we're disciplined, discipline wins you two additional games per year. Uh, number two, uh, we have to play 60 minutes of assignment football. You know, the bottom line is not making mistakes. If we can play 60 minutes of assignment football, we will win the football game. And the bottom line, the last one, is turnovers. We can't turn it over, and I'm looking to disturb that ball on defense. We have uh, one of the biggest things that we talk about early on uh, as a defensive staff is disturbing the football. We want to put our hands on that ball every time the ball is snapped. Somebody stripping it, somebody going after it, and different things like that. So we want to control and, and uh, not turn the ball over, but yet on defense we want to turn that thing over. You want to short feet? Yes, sir. Our special teams. <clears throat> We talked about offense, teams, we talked about defense. Yes, sir. Teams. Our special teams are coming along real well. We have a, a freshman punter in uh, Mr. Grubbs that, uh, you know, is doing a great job. Uh, there's no doubt about it. He's going to be an asset for us, uh, you know, and our young kickers are really coming along. We're doing a good job at kicking the ball. And, you know, those guys are excited. We're, we're ready to go special teams. We know uh, the bottom line, early on in the season, defensive special teams are big keys. Uh, and we realize that there's no doubt about we have to come out humming with our special teams. What type of uh, person are you in handling pressure? What type of pressure do you put on yourself coming into a new job and you know, a new facility and, and really trying to reestablish A and T as, as a threat in this conference? Well, you know, pressure. You know, uh, pressure has never really bothered me. Uh, you know, I've never been a head coach. Uh, you know, uh, I have my experience, head coach pressure. Uh, but, you know, the bottom line, I'm the head of my household. And, uh, you know, that's pressure within itself. There's <laughs> no doubt about that. But uh, pressure doesn't bother me. Uh, my biggest thing, and again, in, in uh, dealing with great mentors, uh, you know, you work your hardest throughout the spring, the summer, uh, throughout the, the week, and all those things. And then Saturday, you got to let the cars fall where they lay. You know, you can't go home, you know, if, if you're up or if you're down. You know, the bottom line, if you gave it your all, uh, you can rest easy that, uh, you know, you can't, you can't deal with outside things. All you can deal with things that you can control. We can control, you know, quite a bit of this game if we play 60 minutes of assignment football. Uh, the things that we've been working on uh, from, from uh, the springtime. You know, we've been working hard in the weight room. We've been working hard doing all those things. So, you know, I don't right now feel uh, pressure. Yes, it's, you know, it's an uphill battle, but, you know, I've been climbing uphill all my life. So I'm, I'm just, I'm kind of used to those things. So the pressure is really not bothering me at this point. Can you tell me about your quarterback call to Pierce? It looks like he's going to start this Saturday. Is that right? Yes, he is. Carlton has really come on uh, this as his senior year. He has really come on as a dominating factor on our offense. That's why you know I can confidently say I really believe we have that uh, you know that that high scoring offense. Uh, you know because uh, you know again if we can stay healthy, that's a big key on everybody's team. Uh, if we can stay healthy. Uh, and different things with the things that we can do uh, with our running attack and, and, and leaning on his arm because Carlton can throw the cover off the ball. Uh, 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 our offensive coordinator has been a, doing a great job uh, and uh, our co-coordinator Mike Moran is doing an outstanding job with technique and different things uh, in working our quarterbacks. Right now, Carlton is playing his best football. I, I'm just so excited. Uh, uh, this past weekend he has a, had an awesome uh, uh, scrimmage and, and different things. Uh, guys are catching the ball for him. We got some weapons outside uh, and different things in addition to have some uh, some super running backs and uh, you know our biggest thing uh, Coach Burry has always been known uh, because he can run the ball on pretty much everyone 
and different things. And uh, I'm just looking forward to Carlton going out in his debut because I really think it's going to be an explosion.